Hola, manale, talofa, and welcome to Season 6, Episode 62 of Breakfast Bites. By Tevovosports.com, a wrap of Pacifica People's sports news on a bright and sunny Tuesday morning, 5 September 2023. Coming to you with tons of anisi from the 180th meridian in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. In our Rugby World Cup 2023 countdown today, the Palms are pulling out the heavy artillery to support their teams in the opening rounds of Rugby World Cup 2023 in France. With uh, Prince William in attendance at the Stade de Bordeaux on Sunday to watch uh, Wales uh, versus Fiji, future King of Great Britain, is the patron of the Welsh Rugby Union. Meanwhile, Kate, the Princess of Wales, will cheer on England against Argentina in the Stade de Marseille, as uh, she's the patron of the rug, uh, Rugby Football Union. In Rugby League, let's all be honest, the Penrith Panthers look very likely to become the first side in 40 years to win three straight NRL premierships. Champion coaches believe that titles are won on defence. And they have that pat down. Down pat, I should say. The Broncos, Storm and New Zealand Warriors are fighting for second spot. In the FIBA Basketball World Cup hosted by the Philippines, Japan and Indonesia, Lithuania handed Team USA their first loss of, of the FIFA World Cup, bombing the star-studded American lineup with three pointers for a stunning 110-104 upset that shook up the basketball world. Since 2019, the USA has only lost to Australia, France, Nigeria, and now Lithuania, who joined Latvia and Slovenia in the quarterfinals. In football, reigning Spanish, uh, Spanish champions Barcelona will take on Porto, Shakhtar Donetsk, and a Royal Antwerp of Belgium in Group H of the U UEFA Champions League. Last season's runner-up, Inter Milan, are in Group D with Portuguese champions Benfica, Red Bull Salzburg, and Real Sociedad of Spain. In combat sports, UFC heavyweight uh, star Cyril Gain may have won a TKO victory over Sergei Spivak in the final fight of US UFC Paris uh, last Saturday. But at the same time, thieves forced their way through the front door of his Paris apartment and stole a Rolex and other jewelry estimated at U.S. $162,000. For TavoVoSports.com, I'm Calden Kamir. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons below if you want to receive more Pacifica Sports highlights on Breakfast Bites. Mahalo, kakite, and thank you all too much for all your love and support.